today I am bringing you guys yet another haul. And this haul, I will say, is the most exciting thus far. Because I am super excited to show y'all these dresses that I got. Y'all don't understand how long I have waited to receive these dresses. Like, I've been stressed. And I think I created, in, created anxiety. Because I've been waiting for these dresses. I did not know if they were going to fit correctly. <sighs> like, we're going to get into the things, okay? But let me start off by saying, super exciting. Because I reached 100 subscribers yesterday, y'all. Okay. So I know some of y'all, like, 100. Okay. But to me, that is a huge accomplishment because that means that a hundred people genuinely like what I do. They like my page. They like my personality. They like me and the way I'm doing things on my channel. And that is very, it's exciting. So I'm proud of myself, big pat on my back because Look, it's just very, very exciting, okay? That's all I can say. I was so happy, I was so excited. I had put on my social media, I was three subscribers away from 100, and I wanted to reach those three by the end of yesterday. And I did, and it was so, so, so exciting, y'all. I felt so proud of myself. You would've thought, would thought I reached a million. Like, I was really proud of myself. You just, you don't understand the backstory, but I was really, I was really excited. And proud of myself so thank you guys who have subscribed to me who believe in me who like what I do how I'm doing things on my channel those who support me I really 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 do appreciate you guys and I'm just I'm very grateful and I just hope it just keep coming in keep flowing in the love and the support I'm just taking it all in give it to me just give it to me Anyway, all right, so let's get going. Um, okay, so let me tell y'all. Hold on, disclaimer. Okay, so I know I got two nails missing, all right? I know you're gonna see this throughout the video. Mind your business, okay? You know when one nail come off, it seems like all the other nails wanna follow. So, mind your business. I already know. You ain't gotta bring it to my attention. Peace. I see, okay? <laughs> anyway, so let's finally get into it. So let me tell y'all, I seen Lovely Wholesale. It was one of those like social media, like Instagram ads or whatever. You know them ads, like another, I think it was Cup She and Shein that I seen. And I'm like, I don't know. Like, you don't know if they're gonna fit. You don't know if it's a janky company. You don't know if they gonna, you know, screw you over. You don't know if the material's gonna be right. You just don't know, right? But I was seeing so many pretty outfits and the pricing was so low. I said, somebody lying. This ain't right, somebody lying. So I was like, let me just go ahead and take a chance. So what I did was I went onto the website and I thoroughly looked at the clothes, looked at the material, looked at the, the size chart, looked at the inches. Like that's important ladies. And I said this before in one of my videos, if a, a company doesn't have like 3x, 4x, 22, 24, 26, 28 type of sizes and they only go by inches, it's important that you measure yourself to know what your bust is, your hips, your waist. Know your inches because you can also go by your inches to determine what outfit to get. And this company, if I'm not mistaken, went by the inches instead of 3x, 4x, you know what I'm saying, the number size. So the sizes was pretty close. They were pretty close to, I mean, the inches were pretty close to my measurements. And if you don't know where to get measured, I went to Torrid a couple years ago and got um, measured, but you can also buy yourself a measuring tape, buy you a long measuring tape and you can Google and it'll give you like a map to show you how, how to place the measurement under your bust 
to get your bust, me your bust measurements. It'll show you where to measure around your waist to get the correct waist measurements. So you can just research and Google all that stuff. You can either go to Torrid or Lane Bryant, any plus size store, see if they can measure you or buy you a measuring tape and, um, and just go online and see exactly where do you place the measuring tape to get the proper measurements. So, did all that and I looked online and I was just like, these are so, so cute and they so cheap. Just like, Jesus, please don't let me sit here and waste all my money. And they don't fit because I'm be so mad. And these are so cute. So, I ordered them, right? Mind you, I'm geeked. I mean, these dresses are gorgeous. When I show y'all, these dresses are so pretty. So I, I'm, I ordered, I put my order in on May 1st. May 1st. You know, I'm just now getting my stuff maybe three weeks ago, two or three weeks ago. I was sitting here typing and emailing. I'm like, what the heck, man? I'm like, where's my stuff? I'm already, like, I already get it. Everything is not gonna fit. And y'all sit here and it's been, I'm talking about it's the pandemic, so now I gotta really wait a long time. Like, what is going on? I ordered $120 worth of clothes. <sighs> I know y'all ain't jit me. I was so, uh, when they got here, honey, it was worth the wait, okay? Let me tell y'all, I ordered seven to eight, out. I wanna say eight dresses. I ordered eight dresses. Out of the eight dresses, seven of them fit correctly. Well, let me take that back. They all fit, right? They all fit. Mm, could be a little bit bigger in certain areas, but most, for the most part, nine times out of 10, they most fit. One of them, I kind of really don't like. But anyway, point is, I was 100% satisfied with the clothes. Do you hear me? 100% satisfied with the clothes. I was so excited. I ain't never wanna cry in my life over no dress, over no clothes at that, okay? I know I'm talking a lot, but I, I gotta give you the backstory. I, gotta, I want you to feel where I'm coming from with this, okay? I've been so excited to show y'all these clothes. You don't understand. And, Anyway, let's get into it. This outfit, now I know y'all have seen this outfit on, like I said, the Instagram ads. So, this outfit, isn't this really cute, y'all? Let's get into it. So, first off, I have the wrong bra on. I should have worn my black bra, but I didn't want to wear my black bra. And it's just got this big old gap in it. Now, that is because I do feel like, okay, so let me, okay. Let me just get down to the nitty gritty. All right, so we have this long dress here, a long maxi dress. Y'all know I love maxi dresses. That's my go-to in the summertime. You can't tell me nothing, no maxi dress, right? So it fits really, really good. It does, right? I, I will say, now this was a 5XL. And I ordered, I'm about a 3X, 4X, now I'm a 4X since I had the baby, whatever. But I, I ordered a 5X because if I don't know the size, like if your size is not accurate to me, I'm gonna order some, a, a bigger size just in case it don't fit right. So I ordered a 5XL. This dress was $17.49, literally all of the dresses, and I'm, I'm not lying to you. All eight of the dresses were under $20. All of these dresses were $17. One dress I think was $14. One dress I think was $18. And the rest of them were $17. I'm not lying to you. That's why I was scared. I'm like, are you serious? That cute dress is only $17? I know you lying. Well, it wasn't. So, okay, so at the top, as you see, I'm a busty girl now. I, either it's because I'm very busty at the top and it has this going on, or uh, I just may need a bigger size and that's why this is going on. But nevertheless, I would definitely wear a black bra or a tank top, or I would probably pin this together um, so that it'll stay closed, because I hate when you have that little hole in the front. It's just so tacky to me, but I would more likely wear a black bra underneath this. Um, but, okay, so let's start off with the sleeves. 
it's comfortable the type of material is giving me very sheet material um, like sheets on your bed it's giving me that kind of material so it's very thin it's very lightweight um, it does have a little bit of stretch to it but not too much it is a little tight in the arm area um, but I can still move around you know what I'm saying I will be honest you don't want to kind of do all of this because it that's about the extent of your stretch um, but it's still comfortable like I can still move around I don't feel like I'm gonna bust out like a busted like a, a can of biscuits however you just want to be cautious you know what I'm saying you ain't doing too much when you rip and tear but nevertheless I still do like it I, I think this is a really really pretty dress um, so it's a full button down so it buttons all the way down and it does have a belt a lot of these dresses I want to say six out of these eight dresses come with belts I don't know what it is with oh I didn't even did I mention the name of the company I don't even think I mentioned the name of the I was this is how excited I am I didn't even mention the name I mean clearly you'll see the name of the title but I didn't even mention the name if I did I don't know I can't remember but if I didn't I'm super excited I'm so thirsty to tell y'all I just forgot to tell y'all the name of the damn thing excuse the language but the name of the company is Lovely Wholesale, which you guys can clearly see in the title. But I don't know what it is with Lovely Wholesale. They, like, they really like belts, I guess, because, like, majority of all of them came with belts. Um, so this is a belt, which obviously accentuates. And this is why I say I will need a bigger size, because you see how this lining here, the lining is typically supposed to go under here, under your bra line. And because, like I said, either I'm too busty for this dress, or um, I need a bigger size, it looks like this. And I, I really don't like it like that, I'll be honest, but because this dress is so cute to me, I'm still gonna rock it. I'm still gonna rock it out. I mean, I can keep doing this to see if it'll go underneath the, the breast line, but it's not, and that's fine, because I'm still gonna rock it, like whatever. I just think it's so cute. But anyway, so here's the belt, and I would definitely wear it with the belt, because it gives me more of that that waistline honey that maxi dress type of look so I definitely will wear it. I just hate the fact that my, that my line is all the way up to my nipples like it's not supposed to be like that but I will still wear it I don't care who cares not me I'm just gonna be doing this all day it doesn't have pockets which is okay, which is cool. But I just really love the way this dress looks. I love the color pattern. Pattern. I'm a color girl, so I just love the color pattern. Clearly, red lipstick will be worn with this dress. Um, and then here's the back. A big old sun on the butt. Well, it looks like the sun. Boom, Target. <laughs> anyway, this is what it looks like in the back. So I just think this is so cute. I didn't spent a long time on this one dress. I know I gave y'all a lot of information, but like I said, I gotta give you the backstory. You gotta know where I'm coming from. So anywho, so this is the first dress. This is what it looks like, 5XL. Of course, I will give you all the information in the description again, um, in the all the information, the prices and stuff, and the links in the description box below. But this, it doesn't have a name. The dresses didn't have a name. Like when I looked at the my receipt, it just said blue. So it doesn't have a name for the dress. So this is what it is. Look at this so cute. Definitely wear some sandals, some cute sandals, maybe some wedges. I don't know. But um, yeah. All right. So on to the next dress. Okay, guys. So here we have the second dress. Now this one, I love this one too because this thing is long, honey. Like this thing is draping on the floor. Do you hear me? <sighs> so we have a navy blue, white and white striped dress here, maxi dress. I love the way that this flows. I love the way that, the way that they stitched this, made this, whatever you wanna say, it just, it just falls off the boob, right? It falls off the boob and it just, it just covers all of that, you know? 
and then on the side you just kind of accentuate your curves and I just I love it the material is uh, very very you see this girls so if you got a stomach like I do like I have a stomach the majority of my weight is in my stomach right so it'll look like I'm pregnant even when I'm not and so this kind of dress it covers all of that right it just covers you have so much room like so much room um so the material is really really stretchy it's really really soft um it, it is a zipper in the back so here's the back and then you just zip it up in the back And then, yeah, I mean, I, I don't have a lot to say. It's just, it's 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 simple, it's pretty. If y'all can see my bra, I'm sorry. Like I said, I think I wore the wrong bra. I shouldn't have a baby. I don't know what the heck I was thinking. But, um, so yeah, it's not a lot I can say. It is very, very comfortable. The arms and the sleeve part is not like the other dress because again, this material is very much more stretchy than that one. So I can move jumper jacks if I want to, but I'm not. Hey, I don't, I don't remember the last time I did a jumper jack. These girls, poof, poof. <laughs> even if I was to do it, like that's too much. Like I can't, I'm not gonna sit here and slap box with my boobs. I've been talking a lot about my boobs. <sighs> Whatever, come on, see what I, you doing too much. Anyway. So it's just really, really, oh, that's what I wanted to mention. All right, okay, now, I know you've been looking at my background. I know you've been looking over here at this silver, you know, background here, mind your business, okay? I know you've been looking at the little thing over here, what's that sticking out, mind your business. <sighs> I'm trying different angles, okay? I'm trying different angles and the way I want to record and the background I want it, I just, I can't do that right now. So this is what you get. So get out of my background, get out of my business, okay? Cause I know y'all looking. If y'all like me, I'm the type, I look at everything else but the person in the middle. I'm looking at everybody in the background. I'm that kind of nosy. And I know some of y'all the same way too. Mind your business, okay? This is where you need to be looking at. Anyway. I know look a mess, y'all. Whatever. Anyway, but yeah, so cute. I love it. I again, I love the fact that it reaches to the floor. Like it's just so. <sighs> and then when you do this, like if you hold, cause see, this is my stand, right? See, this is my stand. If you know me, you see my pictures. Majority, ninety-seven percent of my pictures is like this, right? So when I do this, I mean, it just. It's just, it, it accentuate my, my, my hips, my side, but then the dress is still flowing in the front. Like, it's just so cute to me, this angle. Maybe it look different on camera, but in the mirror, honey. Mm. It's giving me very navy vibes. I think navy is when they wear blue and red, white, right? It's giving me very navy vibes. But it's cute. It's very breezy. And I'm hot right now. All right, I'm doing too much. So this is, I think, a 5XL as well. Again, all the information is in the specific sizes will be down in the description box. This is probably $17 too. So yeah, this is what we have. All right, on to the next one. Okay guys, so here we have the third look. Now, I know what you think. Oh, and the girl, the model, she looked real cute in it. So I thought, I mean, and I didn't know, okay, so let's get into this. So this is like a short type of dress, but I didn't know all of this was gonna be out. I mean, it's cute. It's real, real cute. I get it. I, I get what they were doing with it. But I'm not gonna wear this nowhere. I, and I'm gonna tell y'all now, this outfit, I'm gonna sell, because I'm not wearing it. I will say the other outfits, y'all. Let me not use this hand. The other outfits, I'm not gonna sell. <laughs> That's how much I love them. I'm sorry, but this one I'm definitely selling. And I'm sure it's a girl out there 
that is really gonna love this and it's gonna look bomb on her. But, and I'm not saying it don't look bomb on me, but where am I going in it? I'm not going nowhere but like to a beach or something. I'm not. All right, so let's get into it. It's cute though, it's really, really cute. So it's a short set underneath. Let's just move this out the way. It's a, sh and you see how I keep rolling Keep rolling, 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 rolling. Okay, whatever. Um, so it keep rolling up, as you can see, and that's gonna bother the heck out of me. So, but we have a short set here, and I see what I, I I get what they were doing. They were putting this in front of it to cover up your stomach, to cover up your food pot. I get it. I get what y'all was doing. I appreciate it, but I'm just not that girl and all this out, but it's cute. So it flares out in the back, like this. It feel like it just sit on my butt, like it's just boom. Cause it's definitely just hanging and just drifting over my butt. <laughs> and then the, so the top is a hold the top look, as you can see. <clears throat> now, obviously you would wear a strapless bra or something with this. Um, or a cute little bralette that may match or something like that. Um, I like the way it got my boobs looking right, looking tight. I just, but it's just, it's, it's cute. Like, I don't, maybe if it was a dress, a skirt underneath or the shorts were a little bit longer, but I just, I feel like I got, you know, I just, my style it's cute I would just have to but I, I would have to wear this at a place like I'm um, like a ratchet place like it's giving me ratchet vibes I mean just to be honest so I would definitely have to wear this at a ratchet place and I don't go to a lot of ratchet places at all so I guess I just won't be wearing it <laughs> but you know I think it's cute I think it's cute, you know, it just, it makes me very much want to. <laughs> it did it do, it just makes me want to be stanking it. Like, and y'all, y'all know what I mean. Y'all girls, y'all know what I mean when I'm saying that. But it just, uh, this ain't gonna work. So anywho, I think this is probably maybe about 14, 18 or 17, one of those prices. This is, again, and I did look, so some of the dresses I got a 4XL, some of the dresses got a 5XL. So, um, but needless to say, they all, you know, they all fit, sorta. This one, it's just, I mean, I'm not uncomfortable as far as like, it's not like tight or anything like that. It's just the fact that I'm doing this, I'm doing this all in the video. What do you think I'm gonna do all that for? And it's just gonna be rolling up. Not for me. So, girls, I will definitely be selling this. Be on the lookout. So, we're gonna go on to the next item, guys. Woohoo! <laughs> okay, guys, so here we have, I think, our fourth dress. This dress, like the color of it and the pattern, it's giving me very, not Moroccan, but very Middle Eastern type of style, type of colors, type of look. Um, where it's very fully covered um, head to toe as far as from here to here. Um, the dress is long, it covers, it comes about to the right top, right on top of my, my feet. Really, 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 really cute. I really, really like this. Like it's just giving me a different kind of vibe, like a night out vibe, like real just I don't know, I can't explain it. I don't wanna sound rude or whatever, but it's really giving me that kind of Middle Eastern colors type of vibe. Um, it has pearls embedded on it. The sleeves are very layered. Also it has like pearls on it. I think this is just really, really cute. Really, really comfortable. This is giving me very satin scarf type of material. Y'all know like we have, we wear a silk scarf or a silk bonnets, you know you know, black girls call it scarves, but our bonnets, whatever you want to say, um, that silk material, this is what it's giving me. 
Like it's very, very stretchy, very, very soft, very, very comfortable. This is the belt. I told you a lot of them, the last two, I think it was, yeah, the last two didn't have a belt, but this, I don't know what I'm supposed to, I mean, I guess I can, a lot of these belts I will probably wear as a headband. I think it's cute when you have like a headband set, like something like this type of thing, you know, not around here, but you know what I'm saying? Um, if I don't really want to wear the belt around my waist, I'll, I'll wear it as a, as a headband piece. It kind of match. I mean, I guess this is kind of cute, but I don't see no purpose. Like, I don't see what the belt is accentuating. So I don't really see a purpose in wearing it like this. It's okay, it's cute, but I'd rather not wear it with the belt. I'd rather just wear it by itself and just probably make this a headpiece. Um, or not wear it at all. It's totally up to you. But this is really, really cute. I like this. This is what the back looks like. Very, very cute, y'all. It's very cute, very light, free. It's not heavy material. Very breeze through. This is probably a four or five X. Again, I'll put it down below, I'm not sure. Another dress under, like literally I'm not playing with you. Each dress is under $20, I'm not lying. I spent a total of $120.43 for eight dresses. So, yeah. So, this is what it looks like. I don't know what to do with this thing. Yes. <laughs> anyway, so we're gonna go on to our next dress. Okay guys, so here we have, I didn't lost count. I think it's our fifth dress. <laughs> I didn't lost count. Um, okay, all right, so this dress, if you if you remember, is very much similar to, I think the first dress I had on, um, different colors, but very similar, I think exact same pattern, um, but still very, very cute. I like this one too. The first one I like the best, I don't know, I mean, I like them all, so I can't say which one's the best, because I, I really like them all. But I just, I really like, I, I really like these two. Maybe it's the patterns and all the colors that's doing it for me. Um, now this dress, this dress fits a little bit tighter than the first one. Um, simply because I couldn't even, I couldn't even, I couldn't even button. Like I buttoned it and then it was, it was pulling like on his last leg and I was afraid the button was gonna pop and hit you in the face. So I didn't want to do that to you. Um, so I just left it open. Now I'm not opposed to leaving it open, but I would definitely probably wear like a cute bralette underneath or a cute regular bra or something underneath here if I want to leave it open. Um, Cause it, it, it just, it definitely wasn't working. Whew, it definitely wasn't working. Um, so either, like I said, either my, my, boob are, my boobs are too big for these type of dresses or um, if you guys hear something, my daughter woke up. It's like seven, eight o'clock in the morning right now. Um, so she woke up. <laughs> so you hear her in the background. That's her. Um, but anywho, so yeah, either my boobs are too big for this dress or I need a bigger size. Nevertheless, I would still wear this dress. I, it's, to me, it's just that cute. I don't care how I may look a little weird, a little off. I still think I look cute and I still think I can definitely pull this off. Um, the arms are tight. I will say the arms are tight, so if you're doing one of these numbers, you may bust it in the back. I'm just being honest, but again, you shouldn't be flexing it, you know, anyway. <laughs> um, and then this comes with a belt. Like I said, the other one, I would definitely keep the belt on with this one because it just gives this, I mean, well, no, I don't like it. I don't like it without the belt. Again, you see how the lining is supposed to go underneath my boobs? Yeah, it doesn't do that. So. But I think definitely when I lose me a little weight, it's gonna fit right. But until then, I'm still wearing it. I still think it's cute. I mean, it's like, you know, you know, it's, yeah. little issues here and there, but it's nothing major. You know what I'm saying? I still give this dress a nine out of 10 only, and only not a 10 out of 10 because of, you know, the tightness and, and all this going on. But I would still rock this bad boy like it was meant to be like this, okay? It don't have pockets, like I said, the back is, it's very similar, except the bullseye sun is not directly on my butt, but you get it. So, 
this again is really really cute i would definitely rock a nice um i mean y'all would definitely what is it mama what is it baby what is it steeple black what is it you don't like mama talking you don't like mama talking hi hi he's thinking about peekaboo I gotta make this quick. Um, I would definitely play around with the makeup on this, but then again, because it's so many colors, I I don't you know I wouldn't probably do all the greens and stuff. It has to really really flow and be really really cute. What is it, Mama? What is this stinky butt? What is this stinky? What is it, Mama? You're not gonna let me do this, are you? She's like, Mama, I don't care enough about them clothes. Like, you need to attend to me. I need all of your attention. Okay. Okay, Stinky. Okay, Mama Kate. What is it, Mama Faith? You want your beer? You want your beer? You want your beer, Mama? You want your beer? All right, y'all. Let me go on ahead and finish this haul because she is not playing no games. Um, again, 4X or 5X. More than likely, this is a 5X. Um, and under $20, another $17 dress. Really, really cute. I love the colors on this. I will rock this one. Oh, I gotta go, y'all. On to the next one. <laughs> okay, guys, so we have our, I think, seventh dress. I may have miscount. I think I have seven, I guess. Yeah, I think I have seven dresses. I don't know why I said eight. I don't know. You can count um now this dress not too flattering in the boob area you definitely will probably wear a either tank top or a bralette with this one too um because this all of this i don't suggest unless you're a small boob girl i don't suggest not wearing a bra at all because it's gonna look real saggy and nasty um I do love the colors. It got like the little, you know, peacock type of design going on. I do love, love, love the colors. I'm just not too, I'm not too keen on the dress. Um, I don't know if it's because it just fits too tight around this area and then you got all this hanging out, it's just too much. And then the back is all out too. And see, I don't like dresses where it has that kind of, you know, it has all of this out showing your bra because I'm not a strapless bra girl. I'm not. I, the last time I wore a strapless bra, God, it had to be over 10 years ago. I don't wear strapless bras because I feel like my boobs are so big that it just doesn't hold. And of course, I know there are a lot of brands that carry um, very secure uh, strapless bras. But I just, I'm just, I don't trust it. I just, I feel like it's going, when I was wearing a strapless bra, it just kept rolling and in the back and it kept falling. I kept doing this and I just, I don't feel like dealing with all that. So either I'm not wearing a bra or I wear a bra and it just have to be some type of top or dress that covers majority of my bra. Um, and I mean, I am, and I'm not really too much of a fan for a person to wear a bra and it shows. And this kind of top, I think it's tacky. But don't get me wrong, I've done it before, but it was at least the same color. So like if I wear like an all black dress, one of them big, you know, black maxi dresses and it's a, a thin spaghetti strap and I wear a black bra. Like, I mean, that's fine. It's all black, it all matches, I'm cool with that. But like when you have different color bras matching from, not matching from what you're wearing, it just looks so odd to me. And uh, because these colors it's so bright, you know. You know, girls with big boobs, we only got three colors, white, beige, and black, okay? And if we do get color, it's very rare and very hard to find, especially when you have big, big boobs. Y'all small little girls can, you know, find different kind of colors and designs and patterns and all this other stuff. But we gotta go soul searching to find them kind of colors and patterns from our big boobs. Like, I wear a 44 triple D. And don't get me wrong, it is possible to get colored bras and stuff like that, but you you pay like a thousand dollars for a bra. I think it's ridiculous, but that's another, that's a different video because we got bigger boobs or we got extra material. We gotta pay so much. Right, mama, you get it? Anyway, 
as I was saying about the dress, I, it's cute. I just, I don't, it's just, it's too much. I don't, I'm not feeling it. Not even to a point where I can try to pull it off. Right. I don't like it either. Then it comes with a belt. Again, I don't really know what this belt does or what it's supposed to do because it's already fitting around the stomach area and the the bust area. I mean, so I'm not sure what it, what else it wants you to do. It's kind of cute, but I'm not sure what else it wants you to do. So more than likely, I'm definitely going to be selling this dress because I definitely don't see myself wearing it. I don't think it's a dress that you just wear around the house while you're cleaning because it's too cute for that, but I don't want it to be sitting in my closet either. So I'm definitely gonna be selling this dress. This dress, I, I don't know. I was gonna say, I think this is a $14 dress, but I'm not sure. Um, so yeah, so this is, I'm gonna call it the peacock dress. <laughs> so this is, this is what we have, guys. All right, so our last and final dress, and my, the last dress I really, really like. So I wanted to end with a nice, cute. So, next dress. Alright guys, we made it to our last and final dress out of the seven. So this one, I really, really like. What I really, really love about this, that's my phone. What I really, really love about this dress is how it really, really, the way it fits. It's, it fits perfect on my boob area. It's a little pickable, which is perfect. But it definitely gives me that bust looking, you know, type of look. And then it accentuates in, in my waist area and it kind of flares out like it it is giving me the epitome of what a maxi dress is supposed to look like it's supposed to you know what's the word i'm looking for you know just gather you if you will <laughs> in the bust area up here and then flare out and just flare out along you it just it's perfect i love this dress the material is fabulous very very soft very very stretchy I can definitely move. I'm not gonna bust like no biscuits in my arm area. I really, really like this dress. Got a little flower here with a little yellow. I don't know if you guys can see that, but a little yellow in the detail. The back of the dress, just plain. <clears throat> a little flower, I think, on my butt area, but that's cool. <laughs> and of course, it comes with the belt. I definitely will wear it with the belt. I think it helps, you know, accentuate your mid area and give you that suckage. I can't think of the right word. But this is what it looks like without the belt. It's okay, it's cool. But I definitely would rather wear the belt to give me that look that I want. Oh, I really like this one. I mean, I'm not a blue girl, but this blue is really pretty. I'm not going to front. Really, really, really pretty. It's just... And I, I mean, the material is very, very stretchable material. Very, very comfortable. Definitely something you can wear on a day date when you're going out with your friends during the daytime. You want to look really, really cute, really comfortable. Absolutely. This is perfect. So here we have it, guys. Whew, I'm so glad I made it through. Almost didn't make it because my child, she just, what goes on behind, behind scenes doing these videos, y'all don't understand. So that's why I really, really appreciate y'all rocking with me. Continue to rock with me. Because <sighs> it's a lot, y'all, to do these videos. It's, it's a lot. And it's hot outside. So, whew. anyway, thank you guys for rocking with me. Thank you for getting me to 100 subscribers. I can't wait till I get to the next 100. And then I can't wait till I hit that 1,000 uh, subscriber goal. It can help me be monetized when I get to 1,000. So continue to share these videos. Like these videos. Talk about these videos. Let me know some things that you want me to, to talk about. Things that you want me to, um, uh, brands that you want me to try or whatever have you. Um, and all that good stuff. So thank you guys. Love you, love you, love you guys. Continue to support. And I will see you guys on another video. Bye.